guys, it's me, Stormy, and let's talk about Saturn Retrograde. This is coming up from April 17th all the way until September 6th of this year. And man, it is time. It is time, I think. Saturn is our planet that is our taskmaster, right? He comes around. He keeps us on check. He keeps us <laughs> doing what we need to do. He's like, that's we're not doing any of that, actually. I need you to be doing this. Because Saturn shows us where our limitations are, what society expects for us. Um, it helps us create structures. These are the things I believe in. These are my walls, right? All of these things that are said to help us be responsible, be accountable. We're supposed to be able to achieve with the structures that we have set in our own lives. So when Saturn is direct, that's what he's doing. He's helping us create responsibility, which sometimes can feel very heavy in particular areas of our chart. And as he's transiting and making contact with other energies, he's saying, Mars, get your life. We're not going to act like that anymore. You know, <laughs> I need you to, I need you to do something productive with all that energy. Uh, the moon, I need you to do something productive with that energy, right? Now, when Saturn goes retrograde. This is a delicious time, you guys, a delicious five months because life has been changing. Likely for every single one of you out there over the last six years, at least, you have watched your life, people, places, things, ideas in your life get extremely different and you are being pushed right now to grow in a different way. And this means some structures, some ideas, some beliefs, um, some methods of achieving, some responsibilities and priorities that you've had have got to be rearranged. Saturn going retrograde, when he takes this sleep, what we find is an ideal time to look over your personal beliefs, your personal set of structures, your personal rules. Why do you have that rule, right? How come you won't date a person who's over the age of 40? Are you missing out on your soulmate because you've created some kind of wall and you're not actually letting the universe help you experience your life, right? Do we need to look at that? What about this idea, you know? Why are you struggling in your finances? Do you have a wall? What is your personal belief? What's your personal belief, Saturn's in Capricorn? What's your personal belief about how you can work, how you can hustle, right? What are your personal beliefs around home, family, your job, the priorities that you have, right? Do you really need to go to, uh, do you really need to spend another five minutes working on that thing or can you put it down and laugh for five minutes, right? What are your personal set of rules that you've been living by? They've probably been very effective, solid structures in your life. Now you get the time with Saturn retrograde to ask yourself the question about can that boundary go? Here's the other part of the Saturn retrograde. If you are in a tough situation, you haven't been sure what to do with it. This will help you to reflect on your boundaries. Do you need to set boundaries? Are your children getting older and now it's a whole new ball game, right? You know, they're not this age anymore. Now they're this age and they need a new set of rules and you forgot to catch up. Oh, it happens and that's totally fine. This opportunity to relook at values, structures, boundaries, and your own limitations that you may be setting for yourself, this gives you the opportunity to take what I like to call a workaround of your chart, right? If Saturn's got a setup for you where maybe you're going to be in debt for a really long time, uh, let's find a workaround, right? We see where you, the limitations are at. You have this much money to spend and you have this much debt. What's the workaround? Where can you find some hustle, right? This is a delicious five months, you guys, and I hope that you use it in conjunction with the Pluto retrograde that's happening to push yourself forward, reflect back, let these things slowly, because this is an outer planet, so these things are gonna bubble to the surface quite slowly, but you will be aware of your own personal style and the workaround you can use and the rules you're willing to set down to allow your life to be big, to be vast, and to be as limitless as you are possibly able to have it be by the time we get to September. 
I love this energy, you guys. I very much so teach you to celebrate and use wisely your retrogrades. So I hope that this video helped you see a couple ways you could be rethinking your Saturn retrograde. All right, guys, like this video, comment, share, subscribe. I love you, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.